Can you create a triangle from any three segment lengths? Well, let's see. Here I have three straight items that I could use as segments for the moment. And yes, as you can see, I can form a triangle. Go ahead and try this on your own. How about these different items? Hmm. Let's try them a couple of different ways. I don't think I'm going to be successful here. It looks like we can have some combinations of lengths that will not form a triangle. And this makes me think, is there a relationship between these side lengths that could help me anticipate if a triangle was possible? Let's explore this in GeoGebra. Here, I have a triangle and I fixed one side length. The black side is always going to be a length of six. The two red lengths are changeable and you can see their lengths written in red and then I just added the two lengths together to get their sum over here. And there's a big reason why I did that. If I create a triangle like this, as you can see their sum is 6.99 which happens to be bigger than the third side. Is there a way that I can make the sum of these two sides less than the length of the third side? Well, as you can see the sum is less but I can't actually connect them. And no matter how obtuse I make that third angle, the sum of the two sides will always be just a little bit bigger than the third side. So this brings us to the triangle inequality theorem, which states that the sum of any two sides of a triangle must be greater than the length of the third side. Let's look at some examples. Can I form a triangle with side lengths 1, 2, and 4? Let's see. Doesn't look like it. No matter how I move these, there's no way that I can get C to connect with D. And that makes sense because the sum of 1 and 2 is 3, which is not greater than the third side of the triangle, which is 4. How about 2, 2, and 3? Well, let's see. So the answer to this question is yes. I can form a triangle with these side lengths. And that makes sense because if I take the two smallest sides, which are both 2, and I find their sum, which is 4, it is greater than the third side. So this follows the triangle inequality theorem. 